Hi, it's Paul Swider with a pop quiz. Do Dodge Neons produced between 1995 and 2005 use a mechanical or a hydraulic timing belt tensioner? I'll be back in a moment with the right answer. The answer, well, it's really not straightforward. You see, Dodge changed the type of tensioner they used in this car during its production run from a mechanical to a hydraulic design. A technical service bulletin was released regarding this change and afterwards the design was eventually changed back to a mechanical tensioner. So that's the type of tensioner we include in our Pro Series 245 timing belt kits, which fit the Neon and other Plymouth and Chrysler vehicles of that same era that used the same 2-liter motor. Now the good news is that the mechanical tensioner works better than the hydraulic one. The mechanical tensioner provides a more consistent tension, especially at higher RPMs. With all these changes, a rear timing cover was added, and not all of them are the same. You need to verify that the back of the tensioner bracket does not contact the inner timing cover. If it does, there are some modifications you may need to make to the cover to make it work. These modifications can include having to create a slot for the back side of the shaft housing, and enlarging the through holes on the cover for clearance of the mounting bracket. So again, you may have to enlarge this hole to fit the tensioner bracket. You may also have to create a slot for the back side where the tensioner is mounted here. There are a few other handy installation tips in the technical service bulletin. I hope this video helps you with timing belt service on these popular Dodge, Plymouth, and Chrysler vehicles. If you have any questions about this kit or any of the CRP inside the brand videos, feel free to post it below or on the CRP Automotive Facebook page. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.